All right, so it's December 29th. It is currently 44 degrees, which is actually unseasonably warm for here in New York. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna try to play some golf. Let's go. What started as a hobby, now it's turned to an obsession. Possible addiction, here's my confession. Here's my predicament, if that's what you wanna call it. My name is Zach, I think I've turned into a golfaholic. 18 holes with my peoples, I'm suited up in street clothes. Hand me a nine and I defeat foes. I'm on the course, I'm getting stairs like a banister. On the green, warm skin blue, dreaming, drinking Talisca, the clubhouse manager. All right, so just waiting on Mike, and it's a little colder than I thought even. But I do see some green out here. Anyway, any of you uh, other cold weather golfers <clears throat> have probably experienced this before where it's been, what, probably two months since we've played. We're getting away in a couple weeks. We're going down to Orlando. So once you get that book, that trip booked, you start getting nervous. Like, where's the golf game at? So this will be kind of like a quick tune-up. We're going to play as much as we can before the sun goes down. I think we've got about two hours to bang out, hopefully, nine holes and just see where that swings at before we head down to Orlando. We're going to be playing a lot of golf while we're down there. So wish us some luck. So apparently the driving range is closed, so we're going to go out there even colder than expected. We are literally the only golf cart. Everybody else is off the course. Whatever. Their loss. So 2 o'clock tea time, and it's 10 to 2. Still no sign of Mike. I hope he didn't chicken out on me. Uh-oh. I see him. Coming in hot, too. Coming in a little hot there, buddy. Dude, why can't we take the cart over there that's covered? That's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, with the wind chill, it's about 32. Because we got a pretty stiff wind going. The starter, who is locked up in his glass case of emotion right there. I'm in a glass case of emotion! Just told me that the last tee time that went out ahead of us was about a half hour ago. There's no one behind us, so it looks like we're gonna be a twosome, which is terrific because we've got two hours before the sun goes down to play as much golf as possible. I haven't really hit a ball in at least six weeks on this win. And the driving range is closed, so might be a mess today, but we're gonna have fun. Dude, it is windy today. Which way is the wind going? So good, dude. It just keeps getting more fun. <laughs> that was nice, just left. Still gonna be a lot. Long, long, huh? Long. Still running. All right, playing golf. So yeah, it's one of those things where you got a golf trip lined up, you haven't played in a little while, and that panic sets in. Where it's like, I gotta, I gotta get my game in gear. So we rush out here. <laughs> 44 degrees seems warm until you feel it on the tee and the wind is 15 miles an hour. Man, whatever, you can't complain, it's golf. All right, man, you wanna do it closest? Yep. It's gonna be tricky with the wind. We've got 120 middle, 140 back, looks like it's in the back. Yeah. Probably all at 140. This is the right club. That's probably what that pitching is. Come on, Wayne, push it left a little. Push it left a little. Oh! Club up. What club, club up? Two yeah. times. That's gone. <laughs> Closest to the hole. Oh, shh. Roof ball. That hit? Roof, yeah, you got roof ball on that. No way, that You're on that guy's roof. Oh! 
Oh yeah. All right, so we got like two days left in 2018, so I guess this would be a, as good a time as any to talk about what everybody's talking about, which is 2019 new rules. Pin in or pin out when you putt. I'd love to know the consensus, so whatever you guys think, what are you gonna do? Post in the comments below. Let's let's talk about it. I say we try it on the next hole. Wanna try it? Say, let's try it. Let's practice it. Okay. It looks like 2019 is gonna be the year of this guy off the tee. That drove me big time. It wasn't even like a little bit. I'm down there. <laughs> He's over, over here. Down there. It's over here. Par five, going for it in two. You better. Hybrid. That's the best go for it live. This one. Good contact, it just hooked a little bit. It's gonna be up there, but it's gonna be a little left. Nice shot the green. Left myself just a little bit of work here on this par five. 71. Okay. Sit on it. Yeah, we've got a birdie putt. Birdie putt! All right, not bad. All right, so this is gonna this is gonna feel a little weird. This is gonna be the first attempt. I got a birdie putt here. I'm leaving that pin in. I like it. Let's try it. Let's see what it. Let's see how this works. Birdie putt. Funny, when you're playing well, it's about 10 degrees warmer, and when you're playing terrible, it's about 10 degrees colder, right? Yeah. Right now, I'm feeling warm, <laughs> yep. feeling feeling warm right now. Carrying that birdie into this hole. Not a bad shot. We're reading about, we got 128 to that pin, and we got wind at our back. I like that, that flag is in the back, so we're talking like 140. Take the wind out, probably about a 135 shot. I like that 48 I've been playing with today. Gotta clean it up though. Oh, <laughs> <that'll work>. Go. <laughs> Go. I don't care how it gets there. As long as it gets there. <laughs> wow. Dude. I don't know, man. What do you think? <laughs> you sure you want to stand there, I think? Horrible, horrible. Okay, number seven here. It's a tough one, it's challenging as you can see. You gotta fly all this water to get to that green. We're about 172, Frank, and it's about, I don't know, 15 mile per hour wind at our back. So I think I'm gonna go about 165-ish, maybe eight iron. Long. 
So obviously it would be tough to do a uh, legit course vlog today. Um, it wouldn't just do this place justice. It's just too cold. You know, the course is closed, you know, half the time when it's, we've had snow in the past, I don't know, month or so. It's windy. So it's more so we're just out here to kick it around, have a little bit of fun. And like I said, get ready for Orlando in what, three weeks? Three weeks from tomorrow, yeah. Three weeks, but look, wild turkey, uh, not far from us. We'll be back, we'll do it in the summer. We'll do a real legit course vlog here. You saw number seven, that hole's gorgeous. It's a great track, it just doesn't do it justice today. So we're just having a little bit of fun. Close it number out. nine. Right side, right? Should be. I, could, I uh, lost it a little bit. Yeah, it's getting dark. Yeah, I don't know. I think it's out. But I think we'll check it out. You think it went out? I, I heard a, like a leaf or something. All right. A single leaf. This is not a good sign. Forget the ball. Where's the golf course? Terrific. We're gonna die out here. The things we do for our Pro V ones and AVXs. Well. Can you say lost ball? Sometimes I daydream and fantasize I'm going pro, caddy and a driver. I'm not talking about a chauffeur though. I'm on the open road, I'm teeing up, I'm launching it. Win that green jacket and that million dollar sponsorship. Rich financially, undoubtedly the man to beat. I'm the best that ever did it. St. Andrew's got a stack. Of me. It's made of bronze, it says bad mother. I'm taking out these busters, Pebble Beach to Augusta. Competition's rolling in the sand. Alright. We survived it. We only, whew, we only got nine in. But, uh, yeah, we're swinging. Some good shots, some abysmally terrible shots. A little bit of a mix. Try to remember the good ones. We'll forget the bad ones. And we'll start packing those bags for Orlando. See you guys there. This summer spent a couple grand with my club in hand. I'm still lousy at this game, but my arms are tan. Fresh air and open space. I get to walk the land. Reputation legendary. Golf until I'm dead and buried. Won't stop till I'm getting birdies like an estuary. 